Hello Stock Stalkers, welcome back to the channel. Firstly, I would like to congratulate everyone as we have achieved a new milestone today that is 9000 subscribers. Thank you for being with me in this journey. Your response is overwhelming. Yes, I am planning for something big when we hit 10,000 subscribers. In fact, I have already started working on it. So once again from the bottom of my heart, to every member and subscriber, thanks for your love and support. Stay tuned for more interesting and exciting content that will help you improve your skills and knowledge for financial markets. With that, let's start our analysis. This is the daily chart of Presight. Let me give you a quick recap. This stock was listed in Abu Dhabi Securities Exchange on 27th of March. We saw sharp momentum to the upside and from 9th of May onwards we are seeing its declining and this decline have turned into a downtrend. By the way, with today's closing, it's now trading below the listing price. That is 3 dirhams. Important support was right here at 3.20. We can see good bounces whenever it was touching this area. Let me highlight, this is the place when it touched 3.20 for the first time. After breaking this and coming down for a retest, we saw buying pressure. Similar kind of scenario was seen here. In fact, it broke the previous resistance and it touched almost 3.85. From here, we are seeing sharp decline, but still support is intact. We can see whenever price was coming into this zone, buyers were defending this zone. But on 5th of September, we can see finally buyers gave up and we can see a breakdown of this support zone. I am sure many of the traders and investors must be trapped right at the support zone thinking that if we see a bullish candle we can enter with a early bird entry. Unfortunately, market broke the support and it's going down south. That is the reason guys as I keep mentioning buy with a proper setup. If we don't see a bullish price action, we do not want to jump blindly in the market so that it can either hit our stop loss or it can block our capital. For example, previously I saw this nice bullish chart pattern and this is the place where I had recommended pre-side when it was trading within this descending triangle pattern. Right at the breakout we bought this one and we saw huge momentum to the upside we booked our profits on the way. And again I had recommended pre-side at this support area our target was 3.45 it was already achieved. The reason I had recommended this zone is because this area is resistance, this is supply area, this is where people will start to book profits. And as I keep mentioning, if a particular zone is being tested again and again within a short period of time, it gets weaker and weaker. Buyers do not get excited at the same level because price is not going any higher. Finally, they give up and price falls down. So what can be the scenario? Where are the buyers sitting as of now? Because pre-site is now at a very low level. Yes, the price is looking attractive, but please don't be trapped because even here when it was at 3.25 area, people bought it. Even here at 2.40, 2.45, people bought it and they are stuck as of now. So there are chances you may buy at current level thinking previously it was about 3.40. Now I am getting at 2.98 so it's a good discount but do not be trapped there are chances it can even go lower. So what should be the trading plan or when can you buy pre -side? as many of you have been asking me. So here is my plan I would wait for price to reach somewhere around here that is 2.80. Now why is it because there are good chances buyers are waiting in this area. Previously this was the low that is at 2.80 area at the time of listing this stock in the market. So exactly at the same place buyers would grab this one and this will push the price higher most likely. For now buying it on the way will be very risky. Yes there are chances it can go up but then we will be going against the trend. For now trend is to the downside so let it come to the right place so that people are ready to buy and we join the wagon. So now pre-site should be in your stocking list the moment it comes somewhere around here that is 2.80 to 2.85 wait for a buying signal that is good buying pressure with good candle with good volume and then you can pull your triggers. I hope guys this video was interesting if you liked it do not forget to smash that like button for more updates like this subscribe the channel thanks for watching keep stocking.